Hey folks, how's it going? I hope you're well and welcome to this video. Uh, this covers the Emerald Knight and specifically the mock carriages that I've built for mine. So without further ado, let's just get into it. of the train running and that's all the footage that you're interested in then go to this timestamp down here um, otherwise uh, this is the bit where I talk about carriages so when you get the Emerald Knight it only comes with one carriage this is the carriage that you get it's light tan color with uh, the brown coloring as well and it's got doors there is uh, detail inside just with seats and tables and there's a small chest of drawers here and everything like that but that's pretty much all you get with the engine and the set on its hot pole so uh, I wanted to build some extra carriages to go with it just to well it makes it look better with running with just one carriage it's just it doesn't seem to be enough really that's that's the opinion of pretty much everyone who's uh, got it I think so I did look at buying Sort of like the pieces to make replicas of this and just try and have the same color scheme the same sort of the same livery but that would just be a bit too expensive so i went on to bricklink and found some other cars and the uh color i found that was probably the best value was purple the dark purple so i've built these it's similar to the uh carriage that comes with the train just due to the fact that it needed to look similar and well it would have been a bit silly if I'd built something a bit too modern in order to go with this so it is based on it so inside there is no there's no detail inside yet I haven't done any little detail if you've watched my channel enough you know that I'm more into functionality and getting the job done and these do that whether I add detail or not I'm not sure I've got five carriages at the moment I've got enough I've got uh, three extra base plates as well to go with these so I wouldn't mind building some other things like a restaurant car maybe with a kitchen in it and a postal car as well something else I'm not sure but that'll be the sort of the dark purple livery um, one difference between these is the door pieces this came with a two by two door piece with sort of like a smaller window I've substituted it on these with the longer one by two by three kind of pieces and they're the windows there Doors that open, of course. Um, there are some people that really do like doors in trains, so uh, I'm sure they'll be happy that there are doors in there so people can get on. Of course, there's no seats at the moment, but I'll work on that. It's, uh, the carriage is all my main concern, just getting them up and running. So that's all five of those. Uh, it certainly makes the train a lot better. At the moment, I'm running it with this tan car here. I may stop doing that just because then as soon as I add the um, full purple colour scheme it looks it looks a lot better I think. I quite like these, I'm happy with the whole train itself and uh, yeah there we go. So hopefully you've enjoyed this video, uh, give it a thumbs up if you have and subscribe if you haven't already. Yeah thanks for watching and uh, yeah enjoy the footage at the end of this video.